my legs are on my gun dies, I don't have to go get another gun. Right. You know, I can replace the battery. This, if the light dies, I can either, if something goes bad with the light, I replace the light. If something goes bad, if the battery's dead, I replace the battery. This, I have to replace the bunker. Because it's all one self-contained piece that does me no good. Right. Plus, you see how this kind of lim limits you to, this is where we think the light needs to be on this particular ballistic shield. Right. We don't really care about your input because this is how we build it. Whereas this one is, I put it where I want it. I mean, if I'm getting ready to make a left-hand turn with that, I'm dead center of the wall. Right. There's a lot of things I can do. I mean, I can even be sitting there and undo it and hold it left or hold it right. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's just it's a lot more functional, it's smaller, and it's just bright. It's made for this. This system was made for this for these ballistic shields. I can take this light and put it on their ballistic shield and take that off. Again, you can get any kind of light and try to make brackets and attachments and this and that to make them fit, but that's just what they are. It's just an afterthought. Yeah, we'll try to make something fit. No, we'll try to make something. Make something for this that is specifically designed to go on this ballistic shield so I don't have problems with it. Because if you put a screen light on this, that's this long, or even a short one that's that long. You still, it's sticking off. You gotta have a specific bracket that fits on there to make it fit. There's a whole lot of other logistics that go with it. Oh, here's your light, now you gotta figure out a way to make it fit. Ah, that's no good. The light has not, never really been the problem as much as mounting it, leaving it on there, putting it on there. How long is it gonna stay on there? You tear them up, you get them caught in clothes hangers and closets. You get them caught in shower curtains when you're clearing a bathroom. You get them you know, doors get slammed, you turn a corner and it knocks, the door frame knocks it off. Just the simple fact that the pressure is, when you attach it to the ballistic shield, the pressure is spread out over a larger part of the bunker. I mean, the other ones we've done, the, you know, we've done a little bit of everything. We've done C-clamps, and the C-clamp to hold on a stream light, you end up putting a, a dip in the back of the bunker about that small. Now, you're getting into the ballistics part of this shield. You don't want to change the ballistics of the shield because you've screwed a clamp down so tight that just to make sure the light doesn't fall.